Being a pilot was something I always dreamed of when I was a kid, and I really kind of didn't have the means for it when I was in high school and then on into college. And I ran into a friend in college and uh, at an air show, and he asked me why I'd never gotten my license. I said, well, you know, means, it's kind of difficult and all this stuff. He said, oh, my brother will teach you for a couple thousand bucks. I said, okay. The aerosol team flies World War II trainers, they're advanced trainers, the AT-6. Most of the pilots who flew fighters and bombers in World War II for the United States transitioned through the AT-6 because it a uh, little less forgiving, more, uh, more advanced systems in it. They had to learn how to use uh, hydraulic systems, the landing gear, and uh, that type of thing. With the aeroshell team, the pilots are the owners of the airplane and mainly do their, uh, their own maintenance. Welding is interesting in aviation because some types of welding are very specialized. You, you have to be, have uh, very special certifications in order to weld on certain parts of the airframe. But uh, there are uh, small repairs we can make all the time. Um, and it, it, it pays to be well versed in it. We talk about welding a lot. I'd like to say I'm going to become a professional welder, but uh, after my week here at Lincoln, it's been, uh, <laughs> I think I, I'd have to invest a lot of time. And I, I've worked with some uh, great instructors there who are phenomenally talented. And uh, some, of the, some of the new kids that are coming up that, that are in the program are really good. And so, uh, I think it would take me a while to catch up to those guys. My favorite maneuver, uh, I'd have to say, is probably the avalanche, which is a loop with a snap roll at the top. It's, uh, it's like a mini, mini spin, and it's, you do one turn, that's a one turn snap, and it goes around really quick, and you actually stall the airplane, and one wing stall, the other one just flies around the other real quick and then you recover. And so you do the loop, do the snap roll at the top, come back out. I foresee continuing on with the aeroshell team uh, as long as I can. And at the same time, I'm trying to find ways to fill in the gaps. So we only have 20, 25 weekends a year that we do this. And uh, so if there's something else I can do in between, more flying or uh, different kinds of work, I'm going to go ahead and work on that.